Hello you guys and welcome to the Beyond Sana channel, my name is Shanks and today we're gonna continue with the evil campaign in the Shadow and Flame mod for Battle for Middle Earth 1 on the patch 1.06 and this time in the Shield of Slayer we're gonna try to find the Hobbit, Samwise Gamgee and Frodo Baggins. Let's get it started. Kirith Ungal guards a dark pass into the lands of Mordor. Shelob lurks in these cruel passages. Oh yeah. What is this place? Run, you hobbits. Kirith Ungal can provide you with more warriors. Feeding Shelob a couple of you maggots will make her much more helpful to us. Okay, we got Gollum. Bring his filthy little neck. Deals moderate damage to a unit. Kill the hobbits, okay? I got you. We have Urukai and Orc Warrior Horde. Ort, I mean, not Horde. Horde is German. Um, I mean, how do we get money here? That's the question. I believe we will need to build the Uruk pit. We can't afford to go for the trolls, if I'm not mistaken. Let's build a Orc Barracks too. And let's build a troll cage regardless. Because I believe we can get potentially the power points later on. The yeah, the problem is we have no money. Wait a second, I need to cancel the troll cage for now. Because we will need to recruit some Urukai. And they are cheap, they are more expensive here. They used to normally cost only 200, but they cost 300 instead here. And crossbowmen are also pretty expensive units. Luckily for, our, for us, the orcs are gonna be, I believe, cheap or, no, you know, they don't cost anything, if I'm not mistaken. No, they cost something here. Oh yeah, normally in BFME 1, orcs are for free. But hopefully these orcs are gonna be a bit stronger. We attack soon. Can I, yeah, you can also, you look at this, you can use the bloodthirsty ability also on the Urukai to kill them and gain experience. Uh, we need to feed Shelob, am I right? So, I believe, let me check. Bonus, feed orcs to Shelob. Okay. And bonus, free 10 Uruks. Also, Gollum can come here. I don't want to feed our Urukai because they are just a bit too expensive for this one. But we can potentially feed all the orcs. They cost only 100. And maybe this way we can get the control. We can get the control. Um, the Shelob as well would be amazing. We have Scavenger, and I believe that's the only possible way we can get money because look at that. We can't even use the Vestition on this map, guys. Okay, just feed them. Oh, we have. Oh, never mind. There are treasures on the ground. Okay, we feed them. Oh, I was worried that he's gonna steal the money. Shelob, where are you going? Oh, we have the Shelob now. Oh, yeah, we have the Shelob now. I was like, what is Shelob doing? Now we have to control of the Shelob, that's great. And she's level 10 too, but she has no abilities. However, she's quite tanky. She has 4500 HP, which is pretty dope. Okay. And we have a couple of units now. We can get some more crossbow man. And uh, yeah, unfortunately, we have no way of building resource buildings here. That means we have to get all the money on the ground. And hopefully we will kill enough units. Oh, does he have Forge Blades or something? Yeah, he has Forge Blades here. I wanna see this. Bring his filthy little neck. Do it? Oh, not bad. Shelob is just taking money. Don't mind her. You, you can't even free... Can she... Uh, can... Yeah, Gollum can free them. That's great. Let's combine. Let's combine them with each other. I know you guys don't like to see that. But I like it a lot, so... Okay. We freed a Berserker unit. That's great. Gollum, you can also get the money on the ground. Shelob can keep fighting here. Shelob is also dealing splash damage, if I'm not mistaken, right? No. Shelob is dealing single target damage. But again, she's quite tanky. And now we have money. Now we are talking. Let's build a troll cage now. We can leave this spot empty for now. Because we can't really afford to get way more units than that. I would just like to save the other ones. Um... Oh, oh, Gollum. Do we need to save Gollum? I think we have to save Gollum. More units are coming all the time. Uh, find and kill the hobbits. Okay, we have to find them. It's not like they're gonna come to us. Okay, I see you. Is there anything else on the ground? There is this guy. 
Okay, we have two berserkers now. That's great. Let's get the money on the ground. And we can now keep moving on, I guess. We have now a great amount of army. Should be just fine. Shilov is tanking a lot of damage. But also, she, but also she will struggle very soon, I believe. Maybe we can also complete the bonus uh, mission, which is freeing 10 Uruks. In this case, those Berserker units. Let's see his damage. I like this design. This one is looking like from VFME Reforged. And he has splash damage too. Which is even better. We have also one here around this side. You guys can kill this uh, unit. Alright. Uh, Gollum, you can free them. We have one here. And also you can free this one. Now the army is arriving. That's good. You can free this guy. Chilop is going to recover over time. Slowly but surely. Okay, you free this. Then this. And last but not least, this one. Alright, so let's go. Let's go for a fight. I've seen many, many units around this side. Maybe we can use Palantir. Yeah, let's use Palantir. To get even more vision. Actually, this is a quite big map. What is this? Is this a Hobbit? No, it's not a Hobbit. There is still a lot of money on the ground. And now we can also get the chance to recruit some trolls. Three of them. Let's use War Chant. And also Eye of Sauron. No, I don't, we don't need to use Eye of Sauron. These orcs can die. I don't mind that. Okay. Did we already free? No, we didn't free yet. Ten of them. Let's get the money. Keep fighting around this side. We have a lot of archers on the field. Shilop. Can you do something? I guess you can, right? Um, Shilop, you move... To the slot too. Spot too, I mean. Okay, we killed this army. It takes ages though to destroy them. Because they have heavy armor, if I'm not mistaken. They are so tanky, the soldiers. Holy moly. Okay, you stop. You go here. Get the money. Because we will need more and more trolls. Get more money on the ground. Let's try to kill them. And you can also free this dude, maybe. Wait a second. Maybe we can go all together. From this side. We have not seen the hobbits just yet, right? No, we have not seen the hobbits just yet. Alright, let's go. Uruks. War Chan is on cooldown, but it's okay. Where are our berserkers? Well, you can go here, get the money on the ground. Okay, let's let's fight this. I'm down fighting this. You can use Eye of Sauron to I see you moment. We have so much money now. That's that's dope, that's dope actually. I think we need more than four to get it to level two. Get ready to fight. We need swordsmen to free these uh, soldiers. On screen like that. Volume was able to get the money on the ground. That's nice. Get this money too. We should be really close to 310 in total, right? We release the mountain troll. Shilop, what are you doing? You're doing not much. Let's keep fighting. You can also free this guy now. This map is so dark. Oh, there is one more. Oh, there is also army. Let's fight them. Many, many uh, soldiers with upgrades. Let's use Warchant once again. We have almost 5,000 resources. Holy moly. Pretty good. Let's give them rocks. 10 power points collected. Nice. Ooh. Now we have darkness, but we can't use it. Look, it's not available. Power disabled in this territory. Okay. Maybe we can go to this spot. Is Palantir available? The answer is yes, it's available. There are even more units on the field. Such a dark map, man. Get this, get this money there. So we can build a troll army potentially. I think we need like four more to get it to level two. Didn't know that it's gonna take so many, too much time. Berserker is hitting like a truck. They have definitely forged, uh, they have definitely heavy armor, the soldiers, 100%. Chilop needs to hit them, hit them like three times. And even Berserker has to hit them like three, four times. That's not normal. 
Okay. Is this? Okay. I've not seen the hobbits just yet, guys. Look how much money we have. You can move here. Gollum was just taking the money. Free this guy. We did uh, free 10 Uruks already. Nice. We got the bonus. Hey, hey, hey. Kill him. This range are hurting. They almost killed my Gollum. I mean, Gollum is, of course, not very, very strong in terms of defense. And also not in terms of offense. So he's pretty weak overall, but it's okay. And Shelob can't free these units either, but it's it's okay. I just I'm just waiting for the troll cage to hit level two. That that you know this way we can at least get one drama troll and then we are ready to go. Okay, you can free this guy. These berserkers are doing a great job for us, guys. Really great job. Okay, we need to go to the spot. We can use war chance here. I don't mind that. Uruks. Hey, 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 don't attack me. I think we need one more. Where is Shilob at? Shilob is here. Alongside with a lot of berserkers. You guys can free this guy too. Palantir is available. Let's use it this time on this spot. There are the hobbits. Okay, I see them now. Frodo, uh, Frodo Baggins and Samwise Gamgee. He's Gardener. Okay. We can try to fight this a little bit. Let's use Eye of Sauron. I see you. Level 2? Please? Yes. Level 2. Let's get 2 drama trolls and keep making more trolls. So let them think that this army is all that we got, but he's gonna be wrong by thinking that, since we're gonna, we will get a huge army now with the trolls coming very soon. Are there any more to free? The answer is no. We have also a couple of units here. Actually, just to get vision. Oh, we are losing this fight big time. Oh my god. <laughs> These units are very strong. We need to peel back now. Can Shilop go over the walls here? Can she trample? No, she's not like in Biffy Meat on Rise of the Witch King. It would be a bit too powerful because she can trample. Like a Horus, you know? Drama Troll is here. Okay, we gotta keep... We gotta move on now. Because I believe they're gonna keep chasing us all the time. Shilop might be in trouble. Do we have any more Berserkers or something? No, the answer is no. Hey! Oh, luckily. Whew, I was scared for a second that we're gonna lose the game once we lose uh, our hero. Listen up! Okay, maybe we can sneak them in. Because they are on the hunt. They wanna, they wanna chase down Shilob. So let's let's beat them a little bit into the trolls. Trolls are coming. We have one drama troll. We need to keep him alive for the leadership part. Shield up. Okay. We need to wait a second. You guys need to wait. You guys need to chill. You guys need to chill. Now you guys can go. Because they are chasing Shield up. Just keep chasing Shilob. Okay, maybe, maybe we can flank this. Let's use War Chant on them. What a choke point. We get so much money for killing them too. Berserkers in melee fight. Very dangerous. They are all about dealing damage though. They are not about tanking damage, as you guys know. Alright. Nice. So we have now a group of units. We can just keep, the, keep fighting them too. And uh, we need to find the hobbits. There they are. So, the plan is simple. Let's come here. Let's come here, but just move normally. Because once again, when you charge, the trolls are running. They are running wild, but the drama troll isn't able to follow up. And you need to make sure in many, many situations that the drama troll is nearby to always and consist consistently sport the trolls with additional damage and armor leadership. Damage isn't really very important because trolls are dealing massive damage anyway. But they might be, in many situations, a bit too squishy. And with the drama trolls being around them, they will be able to handle many more situations. These units are so fast. There is one more uh, gold on the ground. 
Oh, we are under attack. Just get the money and then you die, I think. There is no way we can survive this. But it's okay. We don't need this Berserkers anymore. They are, they are dealing so much splash damage. Look at this damage. Holy moly. Oh, they actually kill everything. What? They are strong, man. They are really strong. Slap. Slap. Okay, just keep fighting then. Boom, boom, boom. I see you. Trolls charge in. Where is the drama troll that we need him? Look where he is. Are you kidding me? And th th there, there is another one. Okay, there was a second one coming. I see you. Okay, four is dead. And Sam is dead. Berserk is MVPs of, the, of this mission. Trust me. Once more. Sauron's warriors stand. We are victorious, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. It's big. The big boy. Now he got the ring. The Dark Lord. I'm actually curious if we will get the chance to play with the Dark Lord Sauron himself in the last mission. Continue. We get 10 power points for founding the One Ring. Fi finding the One Ring. The destruction of Are we able to attack Minas Tirith? Continue. Nope, not yet. But look how many options we have. We have 10 power points collected now, which is amazing. And we have two Mordor armies, right? This one, Gothmog, Witch King of Engma, 54 trolls. This one... <laughs> Uvata, Mouth of Sauron, 57 trolls. So this combined has like over 100 trolls. 111 actually. Quick math. We have three Isengard armies. We can also keep fighting with them. Enid Wave, uh, West Mnet, uh, Eastern Rohan or Anorian. And yeah, I mean, I think at this point of the, of the mission or campaign, we need to hunt the power points, right? So we need to attack the maps which are giving us the most power points. In this case, it's going to be Ker Andros. And... Uh, it's a matter of time. We have 10 power points collected now. I think we need 10 more for the Balrog summon. But it can be also a challenge to win the Minas Tirith uh, battle without the summon of the Balrog. We will see about that. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please make sure to leave a like for your boy. Subscribe for more content like this in the future. I will see you in the next video. Until then, take care of yourselves. And as always, stay beyond standards. Peace, guys.